Yeah, it wouldn't be right to climb these stairs with my horse. I think... I think it's supposed to be a somewhat of a challenge to get up there, right? So I might as well do it on foot. What is this? Emblem 1. Before the birth of man, the dragons ruled all Mandas. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for true needs. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. I wonder how many steps these actually are, if that's like 7,000 or if it's less. Okay. There's a lot here to fight. Oh, hello. Keep an eye on the wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. Yeah, did you hear someone call it? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. I have no idea. I like to spend time up here. Oh, really? Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Mm, okay. They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials. But not to make conversation. Oh. Good day. I'm on my way. Um, let's see what this is. Men were born and spread over the face of Mandas. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men were weak then and had no voice. <gasps> oh god. Okay. This may become a problem. Let's get a little bit prepared. I don't know if there's anything I can do right now. Oh, I have an idea. Okay. I don't know how well this is gonna work. But I will give it a shot. An actual shot. I believe I have a potion. I have a weak paralysis poison. I'm gonna apply it to my bow. And I'm hoping to hit him with that. Where did he go? Is he gone now? Maybe he's actually gone now. I died. Nope. Okay. And now... No, that didn't work. Well, it kind of worked. Whew. Tough. These things are tough. It's snowing now, too. <sighs> this could be bad. I really need to get up there. Oh, what's going on now? Oh, these guys. No, these are really strong. These are so strong. I don't like you guys. They might not take a lot of hits, but they do hurt when they throw their spears. Oh, got him. Oof, okay. Wow, this pass sure is dangerous. Maybe I should have taken my horse. Okay, what do you have? Nothing. Are we there yet? I know I feel chilly. Yeah, I need to get going. This is gonna freeze me to death if I don't make it. The fledgling spirits of man were strong in old times, unafraid to war with dragons and their voices, but the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. I still have a spear stuck in my shoulder, but that's okay. Ooh, who's that? Someone praying in front of this, huh? Carita. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path. Yeah, I heard to some. Car. What are you doing here? Walking the steps, meditating same on the same thing. Emblems. Yeah. I make this trip every few years. Okay, she's the same. Kind called on Pasunax. Patunax, not sure, who pitied man. Together they taught man to use the voice. Then Dragon Wall Rage, Dragon against Tong. Oh no. Oh no. It's a troll. If I can't get him before he gets me, then we're all good.
Okay. <laughs> okay. Who? What's gonna be next? A dragon? It's getting more difficult. Man prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world, proving for all that their voice too was strong, although their sacrifices were manifold. With roaring tongues, the Sky Children conquer, founding the first empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragon withdrew from this world. So the dragon just disappeared? Or left on purpose, I should say? Not sure. Oh. I think I see a building up there or something. The tongs at Red Mountain went away humbled. Jürgen Windcaller began his seven-year meditation to understand how strong voices could fail. I am freezing. That is not good. Maybe I have a little bit of something warm to drink. Do I have some tea still? That might help a bit. Just a tiny bit. Probably not though. Jürgen Windcaller chose silently, uh, silence and return. The 17 or 17 disputants could not shout him down. Jürgen de Kolm built his home on this road of the world. It's interesting how some words are capital. I wonder if that has, if that means anything. I really need to find this building soon. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna freeze to death up here. <gasps> okay, I think that's it. I think we found it. We made it. Oh, I gotta read this though. It's probably the last one. It has a fancy statue on top. For years all silent, the grey beard spoke one name. Tybert Septim, stripling then, was summoned to Hos uh, Hot Hotgar. I never know how to say it. Rotgar. They even said it, but I forgot. They blessed and named him Dovakin. Oh, he was Dovakin. Yes. I'm here. I think this is where I need to make my delivery. There we go. Here's supplies. Well, let's go inside. It is freezing. <sighs> There's some heat here. Okay. Good. Oh, hello. I hope I'm not... You must be the Greybeards, right? I don't think I'm intruding. Well, you called me. A dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Is it good or bad? I'm answering a summons. We will see if you truly have the gift. Show us, dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Sure. Fulse! Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I still should remove the spear. I I speak for the Greybeards. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I want to find out what it means to meet Dragonborn. Well, we are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the Dragonblood that came before you. I'm not the only Dragonborn. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only Dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Hmm, interesting. So there might be more than one. Okay, I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are Dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. 
Master Einart will now teach you Gro, a second word Ooh, in the okay. relating force. Gro means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Gro. Oh, look at that. He just summons a new word, huh? You learn a new word like a master. You truly do have the gift. But I just stared at it, but okay. Power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einart will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Okay. That will make it a little bit easier. Alright. Should I just use it? Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Oh, okay. It works. There we go. Is that good enough? Impressive. Thanks. Your thumb is precise. You show great promise, Dragonborn. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Oh, there he is. Look. Oh. Ooh. What was you that? Now see how you learn a completely new shout. Master Bori will teach you. Wood. Did you just get rid of the weather? Whirlwind. Whirlwind. That would be a useful shout to have. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Approach Master Body and he will gift you his knowledge of wood. Okay. I'm glad they just gift us to me. Saves me the trouble of getting it first. Now we will see how quickly you can master a new shot. Okay. Guess I should equip this now. Whirlwind Sprint. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate Whirlwind Sprint. Then it will be your turn. Master Bori. Vex! Wolf attack! Nice. Now, your turn. Stand next to me. Okay. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. I'll do that. I'm ready. I did it. Your quick mastery of a new thum is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. I don't know how it dude it just happens. You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrav. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Okay. Where are the dragons returning? No doubt. The appearance of a dragon born at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Okay. Good. Then you will be ready for whatever lies ahead. All right. I really want that weather shout though, if that's what it was, cause that would be so useful. 